What is going on everybody? Beast HD here and today I'm bringing you a really 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 short video here on the quickest and easiest way you can make YouTube thumbnails for free and I've actually gotten quite a few requests and people asking me what I make YouTube thumbnails with and um, yeah I am a very lazy person and I absolutely believe in the fastest way of doing things is definitely the best way of doing things so I don't actually use Photoshop or anything to make my YouTube thumbnails what I actually use is PowerPoint 2013 and this is actually completely free to download and I will have a link in the description where you can get it from. So uh, basically this video is just going to be showing you guys how quickly and effectively you can make thumbnails in PowerPoint. So as you can see once you open it up you have a choice of a load of different backgrounds and you can also come up here, search through thousands of templates so you can find loads of different backgrounds, cool looking backgrounds that you can use. And um, yeah, you don't even have to make your own backgrounds basically. So I'm just going to choose this one because I don't want to be looking around for ages and wasting time. So um, I'm just going to show you basically what you can do to add text in and what you can do to the text once it's added in. So uh, just type out whatever you want to your um, thumbnail to say basically. And I would suggest going over to 1001fonts.com. I will also have a link in the description for that basically where you can download loads of really cool looking fonts and um, there's no viruses or anything like that so you don't have to be afraid about that so the font I'm going to be using for this is called Coalition and I think it looks really cool it looks really really it looks really nice um, and it basically looks like you've done a lot of kind of work to the text even though you've done nothing so as you can see there the text is quite broken up and it looks pretty darn cute so, uh, and then once you've done that, you come over here to where it says format and add in loads of effects. You can add in text outline. So we just add in that for the sake. Sure, why not? Like, add it. And you can also add in loads of effects. I always add in glow and stuff like that. It makes it look a bit cooler. It makes it stand out a bit. Because obviously you want your thumbnails to stand out. So people will kind of, kind of draws people into your videos and all that good stuff. So I'll just turn that. And then if you want to add in pictures it's actually really simple and this is kind of lagging a little bit for me but <clears throat> if you want to add in pictures all you have to do is head over to google and make sure you type in just search for whatever picture you want and then add in png after it, it means that there's no background to the picture and it comes out like this i'll show you now sorry about that paste so yeah there you can see there's no background it's just the picture so it kind of looks like you've made it yourself which is pretty cool as well and just resize the picture and there you go you basically have yourself a thumbnail now i did that in about what like a minute and a half so you can play around with a lot more effects and stuff like that i just kind of wanted to bring to your attention that you can use powerpoint really effectively to make youtube thumbnails and um, I know a lot of people do not have access to Power or uh, uh, do not have access to Photoshop and stuff like that. So I just thought I might bring this to your attention. Maybe the smaller channels out there that you know just got partnered want to make YouTube thumbnails but don't know how to. Then there you go. So I really hope you enjoyed. And if it did help, then please don't forget to leave a like. And once you've done that, then all you have to do is just hit save as. Click where you want to save it to. Uh, save the desktop. And then make sure you save it as a JPEG. That's the only thing you have to do. JPEG file interchange format and save it. Then upload it to YouTube. And there you go. You have your custom thumbnail. So like I said, please don't forget to leave a like. All that good stuff. And I will see you guys next video. Bye.